North Brabant, also unofficially called Brabant since 2001, is a province in the south of the Netherlands. It borders the provinces of South Holland and Gelderland to the north, Limburg to the east, Zeeland to the west, and the Belgian provinces of Antwerp and Limburg to the south. The northern border follows the Meuse River westwards, where it mouths into the Holland's Deep Strait, part of the rhine meuse scheldt Delta. History the Duchy of Brabant was a state of the Holy Roman Empire established in 1183 or 1190. It developed from the Landgraviate of Brabant and formed the heart of the historic Low Countries, part of the Burgundy and Netherlands from 1430 and of the Habsburg Netherlands from 1482, until it was dismembered after the Dutch Revolt. Since the War of Independence the Catholics in the Southern Netherlands were systematically and officially discriminated against by the Northern Protestant government until the second half of the 20th century, which had a major influence on the economical and cultural development of the southern part of the Netherlands. Present-day North Brabant was adjudicate to the Generality Lands of the Dutch Republic according to the 1648 Peace of Westphalia, while the reduced duchy remained in existence with the Southern Netherlands until it was conquered by French revolutionary forces in 1794. Until the 17th century, the area that now makes up the province of North Brabant was mostly part of the Duchy of Brabant of which the southern part is now in present-day Belgium. In the 14th and 15th century, the area experienced a golden age, especially the cities of Brussel, Mechelen, Leuven, Antwerpen, Breda, Bergen op Zoom in S. Hartogenbosch. After the Union of Utrecht was signed in 1579, Brabant became a battlefield between the Protestant Dutch Republic and Catholic Spain, which occupied the southern Netherlands. As a result of the Peace of Westphalia, the northern part of Brabant became part of the Netherlands as the territory of Stayats Brabant under federal rule, in contrast to the founding provinces of the Dutch Republic which were self-governing. Attempts to introduce Protestantism into the region were largely unsuccessful, North Brabant remained strongly Roman Catholic. For over a century, North Brabant served mainly as a military buffer zone. In 1796, when Confederate Dutch Republic became the unitary Batavian Republic, Stayats Brabant became a province as Batafs Brabant. This status ended with the reorganization by the French, and the area was divided over several departments. In 1815, Belgium and the Netherlands were united in the United Kingdom of the Netherlands, and the province of North Brabant was established and so named to distinguish it from South Brabant in present-day Belgium, which seceded from the kingdom in 1830. This boundary between the Netherlands and Belgium is special in that it does not form a contiguous line, but leaves a handful of tiny enclaves on both sides of the border. A few of these irregularities were corrected, who each Bergen became totally Dutch, but some remain, notably Bala Hartog and Bala Nassau. When the present province was instituted, its territory was expanded with a part of the province of Holland and the former territory of Ravenstein which had previously belonged to the Duchy of Cleves, as well as several small, formerly autonomous entities. The period from 1900 until the late 1960s is called Hetrigic Rooms Leaven, an era of strong religious belief. Hetrigic Rooms Leaven came about as a result of the emancipatory drive of the province's disadvantaged Catholic population and was supported by a Roman Catholic pillar, which was directed by the clergy and not only encompassed churches, but also Roman Catholic schools and hospitals which were run by nuns and friars. In those days every village in North Brabant had a convent from which the nuns operated. Politically, the province was dominated by Catholic parties. The Rouge Catholique Stayat Sparta and its post-war successor, the Catholique Volksparta, which often held around 75% of the vote. 
In the 1960s secularization and the actual emancipation of the Catholic population brought about the gradual dissolution of the Catholic pillar. As church attendance decreased in North Brabant is elsewhere in Western Europe. The influence of Het Rijk Rooms Leaven Life remains in the form of education where some schools are still Roman Catholic and in North Brabant's culture, politics, mentality and customs, such as carnival. Though the interpretation of the Roman Catholic identity in North Brabant has shifted the last 65 years from religious to cultural, the province still has a distinct Catholic atmosphere when compared to the provinces north of the major rivers. A cultural divide is still found between the Catholic South and the Protestant North. But with a total of 1.5 million people and 20% of the industrial production in the Netherlands, the southern Catholic area Brabantstad has become one of the major economical important metropolitan regions of the Netherlands. In the province of North Brabant Catholics are no longer a majority of the population as of 2010. Only 1-2% to of the total population of Catholic area attend Mass, and these churchgoers consist mostly of people over 65 years old. Geography with a population density of 501 per square kilometers, North Brabant is above average urbanized. The urbanization is at the center of the province at largest, where the kite is located. The rest of the province has a more rural character. The province has preserved some of its scenic nature well. Natural beauty is found mainly in national parks Loons and Drew Nen Dunes, De Beesbosch and Did a Groot Peel. On the marshes of the Meyer Ridge at Oysterwijk and Boxtel, the border park Zoom Kulmd out Sea Hide, and in the forested area around Breda. Also, south of Eindhoven named De Kampen is a beautiful area with farmlands and forests. In Hees, also south of Eindhoven, are the Heath areas the Groot Hyde and Strabrecht Sea Heath located. The Strabrecht Sea Hyde holds also the largest fen of the Netherlands. The Buven measures 85 hectares. Like most of the Netherlands, North Brabant is mostly flat, but nearly every part of North Brabant is above sea level. Therefore, there are not as many canals as in the lower parts of the Netherlands. Although most of the population lives in urban areas, the province is scattered with villages around which most of the land is cultivated. National parks in North Brabant are De Beesbosch, National Park, North Brabant, South Holland, 7.100 hectares, 1994. De Zoom Kalm Sea Hyde, Cross Border Park, North Brabant, Antwerp, 3.750 hectares, 2001. De Loons and Drew Nens Duinen, National Park, North Brabant, 3.400 hectares, 2002. De Groot Peel, National Park, North Brabant, Limburg, 1.340 hectares, 1993. De Beesbosch The Beesbosch is an area southwest of Dordrecht formed when the dike on the Meuse burst in the Saint. Elizabeth's floods on November 19, 1421 engulfed great tracts of land in the southwestern Netherlands and altered the geography of the whole area, inundating over 40,000 hectares 100,000 acres of land. Since the 18th century more than four-fifths of the flooded land has been reclaimed. An area of 6,000 hectares 15,000 acres was left as it was and now forms the Beesbosch Nature Reserve and Bird Sanctuary. Until the end of the 1960s the Beesbosch was directly connected with the sea and subject to changing tide levels. As a result, it developed a flora which tolerated brackish water and was the home of numerous waterfowl. Since the damming of the Haring Vliet there is no variation in water level, and both flora and fauna have adapted to the new environment. The Beesbosch is crisscrossed by a network of footpaths and bike paths and by countless rivers and streams which offer excellent facilities for water, sports, in spite of the large numbers of visitors the natural environment has remained largely unspoiled. The Beesbosch Nature Reserve can be reached by car only from the east. The southwest part of the area, with its three large reservoirs of drinking water, is closed to road traffic. 
The Biesbosch can also be reached by boat from Drimelen, Geertreidenberg or Lage Zawalua. The Kempen the historical region of Kempen occupies the southern part of the province of Nord-Brabant and extends south of Eindhoven far into northern Belgium. To the east it reaches as far as the Meuse Valley. The surface topography of De Kempen is very uniform. Most of it lies between 5 meters, 15 feet and 35 meters, 115 feet above sea level. The basement rocks are Cretaceous and tertiary sediments, which are overlaid by ice age gravels and sands carried here by rivers of melt water from the retreating glaciers. It is a typical area of sandy heathland. The infertile soil is suitable only for undemanding crops such as rye, oats, potatoes and fodder plants and thus limits the profitability of agriculture. Until a few decades ago Kempen was a region of heathland and sand drifts with a sparse growth of pines. A few scattered villages subsisting on the poor soil and some small towns, and this is still the pattern in much of the region. In recent years, however, the rapid advance of industry has brought about profound changes in this agricultural region. The origins of this industrial development go back 70 to 100 years. The main concentrations of industry are along the southern frontier of the Netherlands, e.g., at Eindhoven, Helmond, Tilburg, Breda, S. Hartogenbosch. The Peel in the east of Nord-Brabant, near the Limburgish border, is the Peel area, an expanse of moorland extending from Eindhoven to Venlo, on the border with Limburg. Southeast of Aston is a nature reserve which has escaped destruction by peat cutting. Mostly boggy, it will appeal to nature lovers with its interesting flora and fauna. Apart from this small area almost the whole of the Peel has been brought into cultivation. Rivers and deltas The province is bordered by the Meuse River in the north. Its delta flows through the Biesbosch area, a national park. Municipalities North Brabant is currently divided into 66 municipalities. Traditionally, almost every town was a separate municipality, but their number was reduced greatly in the 1990s by incorporating smaller towns into neighboring cities or by other merges. The municipalities in North Brabant are, on 1 January 2015 the municipality of Mardonk was merged into the existing municipalities of S. Hartogenbosch and Os. Economy. Employment is found in the agricultural, industrial and service sectors, with agricultural and food processing companies such as AgriFirm, Bavaria, Friesland Campina, Mars Incorporated, Nutrico, Royal Canaan all having large production sites or their headquarters located in the province. The main agricultural products are corn, wheat and sugar beet, while cows and pigs are held as livestock. Of economic importance is Brabantstad, a partnership between the municipalities of Breda, Eindhoven, Helmond, S. Hartogenbosch and Tilburg and the province of North Brabant. The region has overlap with the Brabantestad en Rij, Brainport and the metropolitan region of Eindhoven and lies within the eindhoven leuven Aachen Triangle. The partnership aims to form an urban network and to make North Brabant explicitly known as a leading knowledge region within Europe. There is cooperation on economic, spatial, social and cultural areas, with a total of 1.5 million people and 20% of the industrial production in the Netherlands is Brabantstad one of the major economical important metropolitan regions of the Netherlands. The province of North Brabant is one of the most innovative regions of the European Union. This is shown by the extensive amount of new research patents by Eurostat. In Brabantstad there are every year 2,100 patent applications made at the European Patent Office, which is 900 per million active employees, mainly due to the Dutch electronics giant Philips Scientific Centres. Brabantstad has grown more important than similar centres like Paris, Stockholm and Stuttgart. Of all the money that goes to research and development in the Netherlands, one-third is spent in Eindhoven. The slogan of the city of Eindhoven, leading in technology, is based on this. A quarter of the jobs in the region are in technology and ICT. 
The largest expenses and most patent applications come from Eindhoven, mainly Philips. Of all European patent applications in the field of physics and electronics about 8% is from North Brabant. Also ASML, DAF, VDL, Vanderlander, Atos Origin, Bosch Rexroth, Seber, NXP Semiconductors, FEI Company, Thales Cryognetics and TNO Industrial Technology are located in the Brabant metropolitan area. The Eindhoven University of Technology hosts an incubator for technology startups and the NatLab has developed into the high-tech campus Eindhoven. This cooperative tradition has also developed into a different direction than the traditional technology research done at the university. Starting in 2002, Eindhoven University of Technology, the Katharina Hospital in Eindhoven, Philips Medical and the University of Maastricht joined forces and started joint research into biomedical science, technology and engineering. Within Eindhoven, this research has been concentrated in a new university faculty. This development has also made Eindhoven a biomedical technology hub within the country and its region. In the extended region, Brabantstad is part of the eindhoven leuven Aachen Triangle. This economic cooperation agreement between three cities in three countries has created one of the most innovative regions in the European Union. The agreement is based on the cooperative triangle that connects the three technical universities in those cities. In and around Eindhoven in the Dutch part of the eindhoven leuven Aachen Triangle is Brainport located, which is a partnership between businesses, universities and the government, and is formed by the municipalities of southeastern North Brabant. The economic success of Brainport is important for the international competitiveness of the Netherlands, together with Amsterdam and Rotterdam. Brainport forms the foundation of the Dutch economy. Brabantstad is the fastest growing economic region in the Netherlands, with Brainport as one of the three national top regions and as a top region in the world. Brainport includes southeast North Brabant and is the hub of a network that stretches across the southeast Netherlands and its borders. The core of Brainport is the Eindhoven region, with about 740,000 inhabitants and 400,000 jobs. Other important industries are automobile production, electronics, textile and shoes. In the 20th century, tourism has become an important sector for North Brabant. The woods and its quiet atmosphere combined with the beauty of some of the cities having proved successful. Another big tourist attraction is theme park Efteling in Kartschuvel, the largest of the Benelux. Language Brabantian is not a minority language in the Netherlands. It can be divided in two main dialects, East Brabantian and West Brabantian. Along with the Hollandic dialects it is one of the two most spoken versions of Dutch. Brabantian has compared to other main Dutch dialects had a big influence on the development of standard Dutch. This was because of Brabant was being the dominant region in the Netherlands when the standardization of Dutch started in the 16th century. The first major formation of standard Dutch also took place in Antwerp, where a Brabantian dialect is spoken. The default language being developed around this time had therefore mainly Brabantian influences. The early modern Dutch written in language was initially influenced primarily by Brabantian, with strong influence from Hollandic emerging after the 16th century. Since the Brabantian dialect has developed faster than 16th and 17th century Dutch, it has become more diverse than modern standard Dutch but is still quite similar and very understandable. About one-third of the Dutch-speaking population lives in the Brabantian dialect zone both in large Brabantian towns such as Breda and Eindhoven and in rural areas many people still speak the original dialect or colloquial Dutch with her. Typical Southern tongue, Tilburgen, S. Hartogenbosch have a large number of people speaking the Brabantian dialect.